And now it's time for a couple of things that are on my mind. I was very surprised to see that the NVIDIA Shield tablet is getting another free Android uh, operating system upgrade. It's now going up to version 7. Now, uh, I've had these devices for a while now. I've, I bought one, and I think NVIDIA sent me the one that we're going to look at here in a second. And uh, these things have been around for a while. I got it first when it was on Android 5. It's been upgraded to 6, and now it's up to 7. It's almost unheard of to have a manufacturer actually support their hardware for this long, but uh, NVIDIA has been doing that. And the big changes in uh, Nougat, at least from what I can see so far, is uh, standby battery life. On this device, I would sometimes forget to turn it off and leave it on standby for a day or two, and it would almost always be dead by the time I picked it back up again. Uh, this time it was on standby for a day and a half and still had a pretty decent amount of charge left in it, which was uh, great. So that was a good improvement that I saw there. They've improved the uh, notifications a little bit as well, so they do now group things up by app, which is nice. You don't get a lot of junk uh, taking up a lot of space in there if the same app is uh, throwing off a lot of notifications. But the big change, for me at least, is the fact that you can now do split-screen multitasking. So I can hold down the little button here, and what it'll do is split the screen up, and I have uh, YouTube running here on the side. I can just click on YouTube, and I'll go back to the beginning of this video, and I can play back video uh, and browse the web at the same time here, which is really cool. It is a small screen, obviously, at 8 inches, but uh, you do have some ability to adjust things a little bit as well. So I can make that uh, window smaller there, and the web browser here will uh, reflow. It'll also uh, allow you to do split screen when you're in portrait mode as well. So lots of cool little features here, and again, they're still supporting this tablet after a good amount of time, actually, which is really nice to see that happening in Android world, because that doesn't usually happen in Android world. So I was very pleased to see that. This channel is brought to you by my Patreon supporters. If you want to help the channel, you can by contributing as little as a dollar a month. Head over to lon.tv slash Patreon to learn more. And don't forget to subscribe. Visit lon.tv slash s.